Hey everybody, Somewhat Girly here with a informational video that I surely needed and I'm hoping this help, uh, helps out other people. I'm visually impaired, so change on things that I use every day is difficult for me, not only to handle mentally, but for me visually because I need to find out where things are on the devices that I use. I already use readers and zooms on my camera to be able to function properly, but like when I'm using this for my Kindle books, and for my TV shows. I need things to be where they are. This is the Amazon Fire HD 10. Came out in 2021. It's the newest release as far as I know. Unless they've come out with another one. Uh, they update, update routinely. Uh, last update was messing with the where it says for you home and library. There used to be so much more. It used to be easier to be able to find things. But they condensed it. They're good at condensing. Which is why I don't understand why they created this new bar up here. Now, to normal people, this might not be an issue. But the way that the Amazon Fires works is this screen is really hard to remove things from. The search bar is always there. The um, All the apps are actually on the screen when you first get it. And I condense them down into folders so that I know where they are and where are ones that I will use all the time. But you can't get them off the screen like the screen. It's not like a phone. It's not like a phone at all. Uh, they added this new bar, which is redundant. This here says to continue the apps you were using. But if you go down here where the symbols are, this X is kind of like the three little lines on the Android. I don't know anything about iPhone, so I won't use any of those as references. But on the Android phones, there's three little lines. You touch them and then you have all your your apps and then you can clear out what you want. The apps I was just using are in there. So why wouldn't I just tap the button I've been using the whole time I've had HD fires, which is just like an Android phone, honestly. Then they add these, the recommended row and it's like, no, 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 I, I don't, I don't need recommendations. So why don't we go ahead and turn those off? And this is how we do it. I don't know where I put, <laughs> I got this back in August. So I don't know where I put the settings app, but there's another way to get to the settings. And it's the one that I use. If you scroll down twice from the top to this, which is usually at the top of a phone. So it's pretty similar. You'll see down here, they've got the little cog. So you touch that and it'll bring up your settings menu, which is great. Then you, the third one down should be apps and notifications. You tap on that. It lights up briefly and brings up another menu. I want you to scroll until you find the Amazon app settings and you tap on that. Come down the list and you'll see home screens. Tap on that. Three taps so far. Technically more than that, but you know, you'll see there's two functions on here. One actually has the recommendations. I already have that turned off, but I think that's for a separate section of the Amazon Fire like pages. This is what we're looking for. This bottom one right here. If you just click it, it lights up briefly and then you'll see the toggle has come off. Now, if you go back to the main screen by using the circle icon here, I think it's a circle. It's gone. If you ever want to turn it back on for some reason, or, you know, want to see like, I don't know if you want to see what it's all about, just follow the same steps back, obviously, and turn it back on. But for me, this is perfect. I'm hoping that this video is very helpful to at least one other person. I mean, I'm hoping that it's very helpful for other people, lots of other people, especially those who are in the same boat that I am, where I want my screen to look the same. Don't change it. If it's not broke, don't fix it. So there we go. Thank you very much for uh, viewing my video and I will see you again. Bye-bye.